Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, House Bill 2359 addresses a serious concern across the Commonwealth with stream obstructions. This is a problem in every county, in every part of this Commonwealth. And the system, the current system for clearing out stream obstructions is broken. Currently, to, to clean out a simple stream obstruction, you have to have cumbersome permits, in many instances, expensive engineering studies. And in one particular incident in Cameron County, uh, I have a municipality that's been trying to clean out a very simple gravel bar that they know is a public safety hazard for over six years. The municipal, this is just one example, but the municipal officials have identified that that is a stream obstruction problem and have been unable to get the required permits to clear it out. And moreover, the, uh, uh, the engineering study is very costly. House Bill 2359 creates a clear, effective, and efficient process to remove obstructions to protect public safety. As I, as I described the bill earlier, it will require the Environmental Quality Board to establish guidelines for removal of these obstructions. I think that goes to the, the gentleman from Lancaster's earlier comments that this is not just someone going in the stream and removing an obstruction. The Environmental Quality Board will be establishing guidelines for the removal of these uh, obstructions. The bill also requires notice to the Department of Environmental Protection before any projects to move, remove obstructions would move forward. The bill stipulates that no permits can be required, that no engineering studies can be required, and also provides for an emergency process for uh, stream obstruction removal. I can tell you that I've met with the Department of Environmental Protection. We've held hearings or informational meetings here in this Capitol building with the Department of Environmental Protection uh, on this issue. They state that they're aware of it. They state that they recognize the issue, but have offered absolutely no solutions to the problem. Absolutely no solutions. Let's work together and send a message to the Department of Environmental Protection that this is a serious problem, and we need to give our communities the tools necessary to remove these obstructions. Public safety has to be first and foremost priority. So let's work together and vote yes on House Bill 2359. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.